Hi, this is Joanna from LoveMySurface.net. Today I'm going to show you how to delete Internet Explorer 11 cache upon exiting your, the browser. We published a walkthrough a few months back on how to do, clear the IE 10 and 11 history, but some folks have been asking about how to do this automatically so they don't have to do it manually whenever they remember or each time. So, um, if you go to an expl Internet Explorer in the uh, modern user interface or the Metro interface, um, you'll see that if you stop typing uh, a website that you go through often it automatically fills it in. So I go to Google often and it automatically fills it in. If I go to my own site it automatically fills it in and that's because it stores the files uh, in temporary storage on your local machine. That's what's called the history. So um, we want to uh, prevent Internet Explorer from doing this. So in order to do so we have to go to desktop. Um, the setting is actually only in the desktop mode, mode version of Internet Explorer. You open up Internet Explorer, under Settings, Internet Options, there is a section called Browsing History, and we're going to tell it to delete Browsing History on exit, and also delete any existing history. Um, I have the first uh, four or five things selected, and that's fine, that's by default. I click delete and apply and OK and you can tell Internet Explorer has finished deleting your history and it tells you so. Then I'm going to exit the browser here and that is all I really need to do for settings. Now um, I need to also when I go to um, the Metro interface remember one thing so if I close it open it back up again and start typing love my surface dot net it works great however if I close it again go back to it start typing love my surface it auto fills it so what's the problem well the problem is that most folks don't realize that just by swiping down you're not actually closing the program Internet Explorer is actually still running in the background. If you want to make sure you close your your browser properly, you grab it just as if you were going to swipe it down and hold it for a few seconds. And when it changes to its icon, that's when you let go. That actually closes the program running in the background. So now, now if I go back to it and start typing above my surface, nothing happens because it didn't save it in cache. So just remember, after you apply the settings in the desktop mode, you then always make sure you close it properly and it will delete it for you. And that's all there is to know. Thank you.